card. Mr. Victorville, Ryan Garcia, 7 0. He takes on Devin Jones out of Louisiana. Steve, you see and live, and I'm known to tweet once in a while. Every now and then. Ryan Garcia, he's very popular on social media. He is sponsored by a suit company. That's the way to do it. You see his cousin Mike Rodriguez working. That's his dad, Henry Garcia, who is also his trainer. Adam Big. And Ryan is uh, taking his time. Steve Knowing and I have a lot of notes on him. <laughs> you know, one thing that's very evident about Garcia and seeing highlights. Boomerang on Instagram. It's a different story when you get into the ring. What's up to Lamont Roach Jr.? Big win last week in Indio. We're boxing this in the lightweight division. Devon, the Hitman Charles. Ryan King Roy Garcia. Gentlemen, you had your instructions downstairs. Keep your punches up. Punches here are fine. Watch your heads. Shake hands and good luck to both of you. The man Roll. in the ring. They're just having a monica peer. Look at the tail of the tape for this one, Steve. And one thing that sticks out once again, Ryan Garcia, the precocious young man from Victorville, just in eight. DC. He's actually at the National Silver Gloves with two of his young amateur fighters out of that gym in DC. Junior also Zungri, Zachary Ochoa watching us from Brooklyn, New York. And I guess Good he's solid great. fighter, both of those young men. That March 11th show in New York will be Curtis Stevens and David Lemieux, the father, trainer, brother of former world champion Cobrita Gonzalez. You'll see Chimpa in the ring March 10th. And of you sparring, young people. But uh, you referred to what exactly is this program about? I remember about two years than a prospect, but we literally see him blossom in front of our eyes. That's what so they this drive around Southern California for sparring. And Victor mentioned it uh, two hours, hour and a half away from downtown Los Angeles. Devin Jones, two and one. Jones now a CIF wrestler, went to state, married, moved to Louisiana, where his wife was always into the sports. He is one in four as an MMA rear because the money's better in boxing. Oh, that was a good right hand. Good right hand. He catches Devin Jones, and, and you can see some of the power and the twitchiness of Garcia early on. But again, that's the reckless right there. I still think Garcia, as he scores a knockdown, needs a better job of, of making himself a little bit smaller at times and tucking in that chin. LA Fight Club, first edition of the month of March or February. And Kai's gonna count that as a knockdown. Spanol, siete, seven. Devin Jones, zero amateur fights. Let's take a look at some of the action, and that was the right hand that I really buckled Devin Jones' knees. It really began some of the problems. And you see the exuberance of Ryan Garcia. Rushing it, and he has to be a little bit more mindful of the fact in this game, Beto, they are allowed to hit back. Let's go, let's go, let's go, I think let's go, that's going to be the thing. He's going to face guys, he'll be able to overmatch and swarm, uh, but I think he still has to mind his P's and Q's defensively. He trains boxing for his MMA side, and you can see the striking that he's doing. That's right. the reason he didn't go to high school because he's going to tournaments. It's hard to find him an opponent. Jones picked up this fight this Monday. Just technique and command. He, he certainly looks like you. And there's a good right hand. And you basically timing yep. in with that lead right hand. Walked right into that, but he hit Garcia did. in the nose, did Devin Jones. You hear him, Royal Kai, one more knockdown and you're done. He's been down three times here early in the fight. Ryan Garcia in the white, and there it is. Oh, it improves it. 8 0 with seven KOs. The lights were Devin out. Jones. Well, Devin Jones kept rushing in, and Ryan just timed him off that back foot and threw lead right hands. And you can see the it's of Ryan Garcia, who now improves to 8-0. He's certainly a prospect to look out for. It's interesting, improving upon his boxing skills and being a little bit more patiently at the age of 21. And you see that that was not exactly the cleanest right hand landed on Devin Jones. Jones swinging crazy, as was Ryan Garcia. If you want to know more about Ryan Garcia, go and check out that article by Mike Baca on UCN Live. Really long fight. And that was, I believe, the third knockdown, which occurred right in the middle of round. shortly thereafter. Here is, I believe, the finishing punch that really ended things, and it was not the cleanest right hand in his previous fight in two rounds. Uh, as they say, the die is cast, and that was going to be one-way traffic in favor of Take Ryan. Take some of the action, and that was the right hand that I really buckled Devin Jones' knees. It really began some of the problems, and you see the exuberance of Ryan Garcia. 
rushing it, and he has to be a little bit more mindful of the fact in this game, Beto, they are allowed to hit back. I think that's going to be the thing. He's going to face guys he'll be able to overmatch and swarm, uh, but I think he still has to mind his P's and Q's defensively. He's got a bite. And that was, I believe, the third knockdown, which occurred right in the middle of round. shortly thereafter. Here is, I believe, the finishing punch that really ended things, and it was not the cleanest right hand. Uh, I think that applies to this young man. There's a lot of physical potential, but I think like a wild colt, he has to be harnessed. Kind of have take to a look at some of the action, and that was the right hand that I really buckled Devin Jones' knees and really began some of the problems. And you see the exuberance of Ryan Garcia. Rushing it, and he has to be a little bit more mindful of the fact in this game, Beto, they are allowed to hit back. I think that's going to be the thing. He's going to face guys he'll be able to overmatch and swarm, uh, but I think he still has to mind his P's and Q's defensively. He's got a bite. And that was, I believe, the third knockdown, which occurred right in the middle of round. shortly thereafter. Here is, I believe, the finishing punch that really ended things, and it was not the cleanest right hand. Trips are made by there. He He's a celebrity in that town, sells a lot of tickets, bright future. Take a look at some of the action, and that was the right hand that I really buckled Devin Jones' knees and really began some of the problems. And you see the exuberance of Ryan Garcia rushing it, and he has to be a little bit more mindful of the fact in this game, Beto, they are allowed to hit back. I think that's going to be the thing. He's going to face guys he'll be able to overmatch and swarm, uh, but I think he still has to mind his P's and Q's defensively. He's got a bite. And that was, I believe, the third knockdown, which occurred right in the middle of round. shortly thereafter. Here is, I believe, the finishing punch that really ended things, and it was not the cleanest right hand. Victor Belzone, Ryan King Roy Garcia! Ryan Garcia knocked him down four times. Kai Sr. stopped it. Ryan ate a couple punches, though. A little red in the nose. You know, you cover a lot of basketball. You know what he reminds me of? He was a basketball player. He's that young guy. That Dixon, who's 7-15, yeah. and, yeah. and worked yeah. out. Had to work for it. He got yeah, the victory. You can see. The and again, you see, right there is, is, a, is a case where he hurt. Yep. Jones loses control of distance. And he's actually in harm's way. And, and control of distance is something evening. you got to keep working at it at the gym. And, and I'll keep harping on it. I don't want to sound. It does seem up there uh, like a lantern in the night. Kevin Jones, zero amateur fights. Ryan Garcia has gone up against Florida. Lomachenko, Sparta Linares, and according to him, he held his own. At the location Spence. at the Velasco Theater and Fantasy Springs. Uh, and then she Dixon, who's yeah. seven and fifteen, yeah. and worked, yeah. got, had to work for. He got yeah. the victory. You see, the, and again, you see, right there is, is, a, is a case where he hurt. Yep. Jones loses control of distance, and he's actually in harm's way. And, and control of distance is something evening, you got to keep working at it at the gym. And I'll keep harping on it. I don't want to sound it does seem up there uh, like a lantern in the night. Kevin Jones, zero amateur fights. Ryan Garcia has gone up against Spart him. Lomachenko, Sparta Linares. According to him, he held his own. That's big talk about somebody building a brand. Now, oh. That kid in Miami, watch out, Pitbull. That is Mr. 305, Belgium. <laughs>